My name is Sjoerd van den Berg. I'm the Laboratory Director for Endocrinology here at Erasmus Medical Center in Rotterdam, the Netherlands. I think we run up to 100 patient samples a day, running them for SCC, chromogranin A, copeptin, tyroglobulin and tyroglobulin antibodies. Every day we encounter patient samples coming from second-tier hospitals up to academic patients which are severely ill. And the combination of those two makes it challenging. We're bound to get a result out which is robust and trustworthy. So that's why we chose this system. So the crypto system gives me, on the one hand, robustness of a machine, and on the other hand, the comfort of knowing that the assays will run smoothly. In terms of robustness, there's two features which I like most. One is the low variation of the assays, and the other one is the long uh, mean time between failure of the machine. It improved mostly because I am uh, confident to talk to my doctors about the results. I don't have to think about interference. I don't have to think about reproducibility. The main advantage of the crypto system is the test menu. It holds all the assets which the major players do not. And the biggest analytical advantage would be the trace system, which gives us the added advantage of not being interfered by HAMA antibodies or other common interference. What I like most about crypto is its trace technology. So the trace technology gives me the advantage that I don't have to think about interference in the immunoassay. It's fast, it's re reproducible, uh, and it gives me the added benefit to talk to my doctors about the result. For us, the crypto gives us a, the opportunity to run niche assays. Assays which we cannot find on the major platforms, for example, Copeptin, for example, Inhibin A. It's comfort.